This week on Renault to Rome, we continue to remove the ceilings and walls from our laundry and dining areas. We concentrate on the front of the house where we try and save the plaster ceiling rows. And we also take out the floor in the lounge room around the fireplace and see what extent the termite damage is. All right guys, well before we get into this week's video, we promised we'd show you some of the 3D images. So we've got some images to show you, so we'll throw those up on the screen now. First one that we'll have is just an overall view of the house itself. As you can see, we have the four bedrooms towards the front of the house. And then we go to the back of the house. As you come out of the hallway, you'll have the kitchen on your right, lounge room on your left, through the dining room towards the back of the house. And in the back right hand corner, we'll have the laundry and the bathroom. Now those are all existing services, so we're gonna keep those where they are. Here we have the first bedroom, or bedroom number one. And then we have bedroom number two. So we have a queen bed in this one with the, uh, the wardrobe as well. Um, big enough wardrobe for a couple. And then we have the other two bedrooms, which are bedrooms three and four. Um, we've got single beds in these ones, uh, smaller wardrobes, but they're all the same sizes, pretty much a mirror image uh, of each other. Bedroom four is a little larger than bedroom three. As we move into the back, you can see the kitchen here. It's a basic U-shaped kitchen. Uh, there's a peninsula on one side, which will give some seating for breakfast bar type scenarios. We'll probably be going with open shelving on one side just to try and keep the room as light and airy as possible without closing it up too much. We have really you know, high ceilings in here. We're about 2.6, so a little bit above average. And on the left-hand side of the kitchen, you'll have the fridge and the pantry. As we go further into the house, you'll see on the left of the kitchen, we have the lounge room. That will be a lounge room. The fireplace is going to remain at the moment. Uh, it will probably be non-operating and we'll just paint it out and use some nice candles. And we'll have the TV sitting above that at a nice eye level when you're sitting on the couch. On the right of that, we'll be opening up that wall and that'll all be one level in the back there. So from the you know, kitchen and lounge, walking through to the dining area, We'll be closing off the window on the, the left hand side of the dining and opening up a big window right on the back. Opposite the dining is the laundry and then to the left of the laundry will be the bathroom. Uh, again laundry we're trying to get the second toilet into so hopefully that works out for us. There is already sewage, uh, sewage there and the bathroom will be taking out the current toilet uh, wall that's in there to separate them and we'll be making it one large bathroom. So hopefully that will give us enough space. All right, guys, well, bedroom two. Uh, yesterday came to try and save that ceiling rose and pull that down as best as we could. Managed to do that, um, as you can see it just here. So now that that's been saved, um, we'll pull down the rest of the sheets. Uh, I've got everything but the one to go. Didn't have a video here yesterday, uh, rookie mistake. Left the, left the phone at home even. Um, battery ran out on the, on the main camera. So anyway, didn't get any footage of that, uh, but we'll get some footage of it today, just pulling down that last sheet. Finished pulling the ceiling down. This is the last one in the whole house. Uh, and then it's going to be pretty much time to sweep up, clean up, and uh, yeah, start looking at putting back in some footings, some bearers, some joists, put the flooring down, get our levels right, and uh, start to look at the rebuild. So. We've got some of the, the plans as you saw that so we're going through some of that. Drop us some ideas and some thoughts on any of those. If you guys have some, uh, that would be great. Well, decent thoughts today. Pulled that ceiling down and I think we might be able to vault it. So go home, have to store up some plans, do some measurements and see what we can come up with. But oh, till tomorrow. What's up guys? All right, well back again, looking at uh, the main lounge room. I'm gonna take up the floor in here. Lots to do. Um, we got floor in the lounge room, kitchen to pull up yet. Once they're up, then we will finish cleaning up and 
then start the bathroom next week and pull that out. We've got the bin coming, so everything will go into that all at once. And exciting times, uh, starting to figure out some plans on the bathroom and the laundry. Uh, a few different options we're going through. A couple of them look like they'll work, some look like they won't. So we'll get to uh, get to that in due course. Uh, and the kitchen as well. We'll have to do some plumbing in there, run some lines. Um, good thing about the old house, a lot of the things are on the external of the house. So running new pipes and things is, is fairly simple. Um, so anyway, we're going to get into it, get some sawing, get some cutting. See so how we go.